Duel Comms are commentaries with two people, and we're gonna talk about podcasts because I am not evil. I am overt flow, and there was zero sense made in the intro. What's up, flows? Don't you know that I go on tangents sometimes and stuff like that? I don't even know what the commentary is about today, but I figured. Um, why not talk about dual cons because it seems like I've been doing a few of those lately and I've been uh, trying to get to kind of work with other people within the community and stuff like that and I'm going to talk about some common misconceptions when it comes to myself and the whole dual commentary situations and stuff like that. We'll talk about podcasts, dual con stuff like that. I don't know. You guys let me know. Also, we're going to talk about songs. Actually, we'll talk about that first. You guys, do you think that it would be funny if I were to maybe make like, you know how my intros are kind of unique and fantastically singable and all that stuff. Do you guys think that it would be funny if, or do you think it would be hilarious, or do you think that it would um, draw any attention or be hilarious or be funny or be enjoyable or whatever if I made like little uh, intro type songs for other YouTubers? Like for example, I don't know, if I um, made one about Wings of Redemption and I was like, uh, when it comes to gaming, you're a big fish. I always hear you screaming in the back of, he of my head. Why did you stream that ish? You're always on YouTube yelling and venting, but you know that we love you, Wings of Redemption. What if I made, like, little songs like that just for... Just like I put them up as 20 second little videos. Do you guys... Would you guys enjoy that? Because I'm thinking that that might be a hilarious thing. And, um... I think that it would be funny, like if somebody made a song about me, I would be like, oh, this is hilarious. So I just figured maybe it's a good idea just for kicks and giggles. Kicks and karate punches all upon those kids' lunches. I ate them all without their consent, and now they all are definitely... I ate their lunches. BAM! Alright guys, so anyway, when it comes to dual comms, this is, the, this is something that I wanted to bring up because I get so many questions about people wanting to, to do dual comms with me. I get um, questions about it from other commentators. I get comments in the comment section below asking me if I can do work with other people. And I have to ask you guys, first of all, do you guys like it when I do dual commentaries with other commentators? Do you guys think it's fun? Do you li guys like it when I do dual commentaries with people I know in real life? Um, like my, you know, my sister, my friend, my cousin, my girlfriend, stuff like that. Do you guys like that stuff? Because for some reason lately I felt like it's a lot of fun to really work with other commentators. And I've always felt like it was good to network. But, um, just recently I've stumbled upon this era of working with other commentators in my own YouTube lifespan thingy, whatever. And as you guys know, I did a dual comp with like Cinematic. I'm, I have one upcoming with Lefty643 or Lefty Ox. Um, also, Kid Laser. So I'm, I want to work with other YouTubers. I think it would be fun. But the thing is, when it comes to dual comms, I get a lot of questions from smaller commentators um, if they can do a dual com with me. And here's, I'm gonna answer all that right now. If you want to do a dual com with me, or you want to, you know, feature me on your podcast or anything like that, a lot of people think that I don't do that because I, I just don't do it that often. But I actually am always down to that. To do that, I love working with other people in the community and. Um, I love being featured on podcasts. I think podcasts are a lot of fun. I love doing it. And so if any of you guys, you know, have asked me this question before or you have wanted to do a dual come with me, well, here you go. Here's the only thing that I require. All I want from you guys is to have, like, I don't know, at least 20 videos up. At least 10 to 20 videos up at least, I'm thinking. And all I want is you guys to set up the dual commentary and everything. I don't want to have to, you know, finagle with all the stuff. I don't want to have to use a Skype recorder. I don't want to have to do all that stuff. I just want you guys to have it completely set up for me and I just have to come on and talk. If you guys want to do that, then I'm more than down to always participate in dual comms. I think it's a lot of fun. The only problem is I can't always guarantee, I can't always put it on my channel just because it would overrun my channel. But if somebody wants to put it, um, it on their channel, I'm always, you know, for fun or whatever, I'm always down to do dual comms with people and all that. And, um, so yeah, that's just a question that I get a lot. And podcasts, I'm always down to be featured on podcasts. I want to get on PKA and PTFO. That'd be cool. Um, hopefully Chaos Silencer and Minnesota Burns will, uh, let me up on that piece. Because I did talk to Chaos before and he said that 
he will get me on there as a guest, but I just love, I don't know why, ever since I did those podcasts with Death of an Arrow, Steve-O, um, ZX612, and uh, Presidential Games, I just really enjoy podcasts, I think it's a lot of fun, and that's all I really had to talk about today, so in the comments below, um, let me know what you think about dual commentaries and all that stuff, and also, let me know what you think about that um, idea about singing people's songs for stuff, I think that that would be a lot of fun, and I think that it would be a pretty funny thing. So, I don't know, random commentary today, I just wanted to kind of talk, and this is something that I wanted to tell all of you, but, you know, whatever. Follow me on Twitter so that you can hear more topics and fancy stuff from me, and I'm over it and out.